That's right. Hello, everyone. It is time for sports where the 20th annual Shodair Soccer Classic will get rolling on Saturday afternoon at Nelson Stadium, bringing in all stars from all around the state of Montana. But they know what they're playing for as well. The Shodair Children's Hospital and our Sam Hoyle has a very powerful story about one of the all stars who knows the organization well. Grace Lawler is your average high school graduate. Lawler, a soccer player at Helena High, is going to Concordia College in Minnesota to play soccer and continue her studies this fall. Though during her sophomore year, Lawler struggled with anxiety and depression. So much so where she felt her only way to get away from the struggles was to die by suicide. You know, I didn't really think I was going to make it to my high school graduation. I had an attempt and I think that's, I mean, that's what my lowest point and that's what my parents kind of made that decision for me. Following Grace's attempt, her parents brought her to Shodair Children's Hospital where she could get better in a safe environment surrounded by professionals who were able to provide her care, something Grace's mother calls a blessing in disguise. The health crisis completely caught us off guard. Um, I think it caught Grace off guard. Um, and so having the opportunity to know that she was in a safe place, that um, we could all just step back and, and take a breath and evaluate where we were at, um, know that she was surrounded by a really supportive staff, know that she was in an environment with other kids that were having similar struggles, so she knew she wasn't alone. It really was just a blessing in disguise. Grace describes her time at Shodare as a cleanse, a time to reflect on her life and the relationship she made prior to her attempt. Shodare kind of cleansed me, I feel like. it. You know, you go to Shodare and you don't have any technology. You're not around the same people. You don't leave campus. So it kind of it kind of gave me time to reflect on myself and my relationships. Now in a position to give back to an organization she credits with saving her life, Lawler is embracing her role both as an athlete and an ambassador for the hospital. I have a special connection with this being that it is the Shodare Classic and I think I know when I was there, it was really important to get exercise. And I think it's important to relay that onto the current patients that I know sometimes you don't want to get out of bed, but it is really good for you to get exercise. And so this is important for me because I'm closing out my time with Montana soccer. And I'm also um, helping the current patients at Shodare, you know, to let them know that it is going to be okay. Lawler now feels comfortable to take the next step in her life and move away to study education and psychology, all while playing college soccer. But what excites her most about the next four years? That there is a next step and that I'm going out of my comfort zone and I'm, you know, becoming a whole new person. I'm like, I'm not going to be, I'm not in high school anymore. I'm not going to be around my same high school friends. And so I'm really, I'm really stepping out and I'm growing up and I'm like, I'm becoming my own person at this point. I'm not, you know, I'm leaving everything I know in Helena and that's really scary, but I ultimately it's going to be one of the best things for me because I'm, I'm experiencing something totally new. In Helena, Sam Hoyle, MTN Sports. Once again, thanks to Grace Lawler and her family for sharing that powerful story. That's your check on sports. We're back right after this.